Aurora has a new friend at school. Huh. What's her name? Darlena. Darlena, huh? Open up my heart and you'll find you never have to look too far. You don't have to cover up your scars. You're perfect, darling, just the way you are. So before you think to rip yourself apart, open up my heart and you'll find love, love, love. Keep it crazy, family. So my morning routine actually starts the night before with packing lunches and getting these all together. That way it makes the morning so much easier. Hi. 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 It's Saturday. It is Sunday night. It is. No, it's Sunday. Sunday night. So it's I love so you. Don't wake Aurora up. I'm, I'm happy it's Sunday because tomorrow's school and I love it so much. Not me. I love Not you? No. You said you love school. She just hates no, being woken up in the morning. So for lunches, we're doing these pizzas. So I really like these. They're like mini pizza crusts. And then we have our pizza sauce and pepperonis. Okay, so we're going to put some pepperonis in here. You wanting to pack a lunch? Or you wanting to eat lunch? Mm -hmm. Pack a lunch. Pack a lunch? Look how crazy the rain is! I know, look how crazy. <laughs> Should you guys go out there? Who wants to go? You should go out there. Ain't no way. Actually, this girl wants to Me. Anyone down? You guys danced last year in the rain. Yeah, but then people made memes of me. I know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> Is it cold? A towel. Ready? A towel. Ready? Ah! 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 elementary school because high school wants to do their own lunch or they've been eating school at lunch or eating lunch at school um, so they just don't want us to pack lunches this year which is totally fine makes it a little bit easier but okay we gotta put all these in the outside fridge so they stay cold for tonight and then we'll grab them in the morning I feel like mornings are getting easier and easier the older and the older that the kids get so one thing that we've done or that we've really stressed to our kids in teaching them is keeping up on their own schedule and so all of them set alarms according to how long it takes for them to get ready usually they do really good but we're still getting back into a routine so some of them have woken up later here or there um, but for the most part the kids are doing really really good at it um, okay, but I gotta start getting everyone in bed and getting that all figured out, but I will see you guys in the morning. We could climb every mountain, we could swim the deep blue sea, we could cross every desert and come back again. We could go any distance to chase down every dream, we could reach all the stars, but in the end, I know where we 
So we are going to start making breakfast. So I normally wake up about 5 a.m. and from 5 to like 5.30 or 5 to 6, depending on my morning, um, I get work done. So I'm normally sitting at my desk answering emails, watching final through on videos, uploading, all of that kind of thing. It's just my quiet time when the kids are all still asleep and just a time to like focus and just, I don't know, I can get so much work done in like that 30 minutes that I feel like I can all day if I do that. So after I'm done with that, I come downstairs and we're gonna start making breakfast because all the kids should start waking up in just a minute. Let me get some lights on. So to feed 11 kids in the morning, not all of them will eat eggs, but um, probably about eight of them will. I usually do around like 16 to 20 eggs, so let's start that. Filling up his water bottle. Yeah, that's what I do every morning. <laughs> every morning? Yeah. So what's the first thing you do when you wake up? So when I wake up, I get changed or take a shower, but I usually take showers the day, like before. Um, but I took a shower this morning and then uh, got my water bottle and then I just pack up all my stuff and then, yeah. And you're good to go. You ready well, to eat some breakfast? Yeah. Today we're having eggs. And so we try to cut up fruit the night before so I don't have to run around and be crazy in the morning. <laughs> How are you liking school? Good. You like it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. What's been your favorite part so far? Um, of sixth grade. Hanging out with my friends. Hanging out with friends. Fair enough. All right, get a plate. I don't get in trouble a lot because I, my friends don't sit next to me anymore. <laughs> For talking? You yeah, shouldn't get usually, in trouble at all. But usually I'm good in class because I'm usually quiet. I don't talk about much people. That's good. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? Good. Good. I love you. Do love you want <laughs> eggs? So Aurora loves hot sauce on everything. She's like Ariana. So I usually put it in here and then she can dip her eggs in it. But. <laughs> Raylan just said she put a hot sauce on her waffles. Um, but the kids have to leave. So the elementary leaves by 7.10. The high school leaves about 7.30, 7.40. Um, so they wait as long as possible because Aurora is not a morning person to wake up and get ready. So we've been putting her to bed. She does sleep in her room, but like one or two in the morning, she'll come in our bedroom. It's actually kind of cute, so, well, kind of cute. At night, right before Aurora falls asleep, she looks at me and she goes, you know, wake me up. <laughs> she, she does not like to be woken up. I feel like she's a little teenager in a little girl's body. A lot of you saw on the first day of school, Grandma and Aunt Bonnie here and Joe and all of that. So they only came because it was the first day of school and they were excited for the kids and they wanted to be there and be supportive and all that. I love that they love the kids and I love that the kids have them in their lives and them to just love and support their first day of school when they were so nervous and excited and all of that. Um, but on a normal basis, they're not here in the morning. So it's just me getting everybody ready and doing all this. It's nice though, because the kids are older now, so most of them get themselves ready. It's normally just like the breakfast and the lunch and all of that that I prepare and get ready, but. Good morning, Brody. Good morning. Love you. How's school going? Good. What's your favorite part so far? Um, seeing Cruz and Noah and Hatch and Silas and so seeing all your friends, are you liking your teacher? Mm -hmm. Do you like your class this year? Mm -hmm. Yeah, everyone's really nice? Good. 
because Aurora is not a morning person, we do pick out her clothes the night before. That way we're not trying to make decisions in the morning because she, she is not the decision maker in the morning, so. Are you gonna try to tie your shoe? Remember bunny ear? So Aurora has been learning to tie her shoes. She's getting close. Not quite there though yet. Can you try? No. You can't even try this morning? before the elementary leave is making sure all their water bottles are filled up because in Arizona it's really important. Actually everywhere it's really important to hydrate. Good morning. I haven't seen you all morning. You filling up your water bottle? Yeah. I love you. I know I'm not looking to me. Yes she does. Yeah but Aurora Aurora has a new friend at school. Huh what's her name? Darlena. Darlena huh and you have two friends? What's your other friend's name? Uh, Bonnie. Bonnie. Okay, here's your water bottle. Put it in your backpack. <laughs> that is really full, Brody. Look how full he got this. I need water. It's hot outside. <laughs> I know, but that's going to spill when you put the lid on. Something really funny. So we do have like an RO system right here where they could, kids can get water. And then we lived here for like six months. What are you trying to get? Yes. Chocolate? You don't need chocolate for the morning? I need chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think we need that for breakfast. What do you this for? Okay, we had a filtered water spout right here on the side of our fridge. We didn't know it for like six months and I reached in to grab something and it like sprayed out. Wait. Like that. <laughs> now I just got water everywhere. <laughs> but then we were like, oh my gosh, there's a water thing in there. So we can use either. Uh, no, that one's dirty. No, it's not. We change the filter every six months. What? Yeah. I'm it's... using that one for no reason. Well, that one gets changed every six months, too. You can use either. They're the same water. Literally the exact same. Good morning. <laughs> you awake? You woke Daddy up? He looks exactly like you when I wake you up. Twins. <laughs> So Aaron and I take turns in the morning driving the elementary. So sometimes I drive them, sometimes he drives them. Are you driving them today or am I? Well, you're up. If, so I'm, you're if up. I'm not driving them, I'm going back to bed. <laughs> Do you want to drive them? I can drive them. Okay. If the kids like wake up and get all their stuff done and they're ready in time, sometimes they'll play a little bit in the morning. But... I suck. I made two of his balls. Well, you didn't suck. Which it's one practice. Liam made the white blind. Liam just made the white blind. Liam? Yeah, totally. Liam's not even playing. <laughs> He's blaming you, Liam, for nothing. Just hit all of them. You gotta break them up. You guys didn't break them good. You just made me get the white <laughs> It's okay. It's time to go anyways. Okay. Love you guys. <laughs> Have good days at school. Dad's driving you today. So here's Raylan's outfit. He wanted to show the vlog. Yeah. Looking good. This is Liam. Sporting the Cardinals that start this week. Yeah. I love Cardinals. Yeah. And then here's Brody's outfit. And then here's Logan's. You guys all look so good. It is really important that the kids take vitamins. So the kids take a multivitamin with a probiotic in it and it just seems to really help. So I do that in the morning. Why did you put sugar? Aurora, no. She literally put sugar on her plate. All right, <laughs> she got the sugar to dip her strawberries in. She likes that, but we're not doing that for breakfast. Dad's gonna drive you. Grab your breakfast. Do you love school? You want the Bruno song on the way to school? She's requesting Bruno on the way to school. She always plays Bruno. She always requests Bruno on the way to school. <laughs> okay, so the kids usually fight over the second row in the Escalade. So every morning we take turns. Today's Liam's turn. Your turn, Liam. And next is mine. Okay. You know what, Logan? I was in youngest. We're going youngest to oldest. Sometimes and kiss and go like the pair. 
the pickup, um, they bring their dogs. Yeah. They do? Yeah. Aww. Maybe Maddie. Not today, but maybe we'll bring her tomorrow. So kiss and go is what the kids or what the school calls it when you drop your kids off because you kiss them and then they go. I don't know. Just the name of it. Yes? No. You want me to kiss you? No. It's just called kiss and go. I don't know why. It should be just called go. No. Bye guys. Have a good day. All right, you guys, have an amazing day. Bye. Love you. Bye, I love you, baby. Have a good day, okay? Okay. Love you guys. That's all of them. Take care. Now that elementary is off, it's time for the high schoolers to start getting up and getting ready. Well, they're probably already up and ready, um, but they'll start coming down in just a few minutes. I love the mornings that Aaron drives the kids to school because it gives me some time to just sit and talk with the teenagers and all of that. The only one down here right now, though, is Max. Donuts. Hey! He had got, he had went and gotten some donuts this morning. Um, but he's going to be filming a homeschool routine, so you will see like what he does in the mornings. But usually we just spend a few minutes talking and it's really nice to spend some time together. Good morning, Lucas. Good morning. How is it going? How is it driving to school? Does it feel weird? Yeah, a little bit. You feel all adultish? I'm getting used to it now though. Yeah. Are you liking school or how are you liking it? It's okay. It's okay? Three, six out of 10? Um. Seven. Seven out of ten. We moved up. Good morning. Good morning. Are you running a little late today? Yeah. <laughs> Mom made eggs. She doesn't like eggs. She doesn't do the egg thing. But she is eating the cantaloupe, so that's good. Good morning. Good morning. You look so pretty and pink. Thank you. I love it. Are you liking high school now that it's been a couple weeks? Maybe. Maybe? It's still amazing. We're getting there. <laughs> we need to do this and ask them again in like six months and see where we're at. Yeah. Are you getting around okay? Have you gotten lost? Their school is so big. No? I got lost. Yet. Good. Have a good day at school. Thank you. I love you. You got your snacks? Have a good day at school. I never saw Jake this morning. Jake! So my knee is still really hurting from <laughs> kayaking. So we're gonna attempt to make it upstairs because Jake never came down. Good morning, Jake. I just wanted to say goodbye and I love you. I love you too. Have a good day. You too. So Jake was running a little bit late this morning, as was Bella. Uh, Bella barely made it to the car, but unfortunately Jake did not. So I'm gonna be driving him. Let's go, Jake. Oh wait, I can't drive with my foot though. Aaron! Okay, last year, how many times did you miss your ride? Zero! That's good. Thank you. Love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. Normally once the kids get off to school, I have time to do my hair and get ready and just kind of get those little things done that I need to get done in the mornings. Um, it's so quiet for the car driving outside. <laughs> I thought it was really ironic this morning that I'm like, oh, the kids are usually so good at getting up to their alarms and getting out. And then there was a couple of kids running late and one even missed his ride. So it was like, oh, normally that doesn't happen though. But everyone has bad days or everyone has those days where it just doesn't work out, you know, the way that you plan it. Um, but that's okay. So the last thing that I like to do kind of in my morning routine is cell phones. <laughs> Let me explain a little bit further. So I used to think cell phones were like, oh my gosh, you know, there's so much, there can be so much bad, like on the internet and different apps and different things that kids can do on cell phones that are just not good, not positive, not productive. And while that can be true, also the opposite is true too, which cell phones can be so good. It's a way to connect. So I love to, after I'm done getting ready, send some text messages out. Um, just have a great day or I'm thinking about you or good luck on this test or let me know how it goes with talking to so-and-so that you know you're getting in a fight with or whatever the case is I feel like I can really just connect with them they know that I'm thinking about them and that they matter and that you know, that I'm here I love to send those out in the morning and kind of just see and throughout the day it's my favorite thing to do while the kids are at school so just so you guys know it was really hard to film the morning routine 
while doing the morning routine because I do a lot of it in the morning by myself. So it is kind of hard. I did say I love you to everyone. I did get everyone hugs. I just didn't get almost, I just didn't get everything on camera this morning. So you only saw bits and pieces, but I know some people are like, if it doesn't happen on camera, it didn't happen, but it does happen. You're just seeing a few minutes of the day. But anyways, okay, I have so much to get done today. So I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go, but I will see you guys next time.